Up next on Lion TV, we have me, Joshua Kermans, here with your updated sports. And me, Landon Solnick, here with a package over the B Pro B Proud truck. And me, I'm putting this whole thing together. All that and more, Lion TV starts now. <laughs> Good morning, Cersei High School. Today is September 28th. I'm Dakota Marsh. And I'm Joshua Newhouse. We hope you have a great week so far. Now let's get into your local announcements. Williams Baptist University will hold their senior preview days on October 5th and October 19th. Interested students should apply at williamsbu.edu. Senior ad packets are now available. You may get one from your English teacher or either office. Ads are due by October 12th. Student Council would like to invite you to participate in the Homecoming Spirit Week, Monday, October 1st through October 5th. Cersei High School will host a financial aid workshop for all seniors on October 2nd, 4th period, 10.30 to 11.15 in the Performing Arts Center. Arkansas State University PAC Preview Day will be on Saturday, October 6th. This will be their only preview day this semester and it is separate from the Red Wolf Ready Academic Open House event. There is still space available for the 11th graders to sign up to take the PSAT if they are interested. The cost is $17 at sign up in the Guidance Center. The new Key Club membership application can be found in Mr. Snow's room, room 112. The first meeting for new members will be Tuesday, October 2nd in the cafeteria at 7.35 a.m. Dues for new members are $20. If you're looking to start your career right after high school, there was a truck here for three days last week to help guide you. We have Landon Stallnaker to give you more info over the truck. Many students may not know of the Be Pro Be Proud truck that was here last week on campus. I sat down with two people from the truck and got an inside look on what the truck is all about and how it can help students. So we have been doing this for about three years now. We're, this is actually going on to third year. Uh, we actually start spring to fall. They come on here, uh, it's experiential marketing. You know, it's the senses. You see it, taste it, feel it, hear it. And so we present them the skilled workforce in the state and all the simulators in here give them a hands-on opportunity to try out something that pertains to one of those professions. While many students have a career goal in mind, this truck has opened up new opportunities into upcoming career paths. We have seen about 40,000 kids since we started this and about 11,000 of them have signed up for more information and seeking training and employment in these skills. Searcy High School is just one of the many campuses this truck has been able to visit and help change. At first, you know, I didn't really, I had more of a set career path, but now it's opened me up to new ideas on uh, easier careers that could bring me more money. I now know that I don't have to get a four-year degree to make a lot of money. I can go to some of these different schools and learn new trades to get more money for less amount of education. If you did not get to visit the truck this year, they will be back and better than ever with a truck double in size. And if you cannot decide what career path you want to have, why not give the Be Pro Be Proud truck a visit? Now let's send things back to the news desk. Now we have Justin Cameraman with our local weather report. Good morning, Cersei. Let's look at this weather. Today you'll have a high of 79 with sunny skies and your rain will be at 10%. Your winds will blow at southeast at 4 miles per hour. Your, hu your humidity is at 73% and your sun rose at 6.59 a.m. On to tonight. Tonight you'll have a low of 57 with clear skies, rain at 10%. Where your winds will blow at northeast at 5 miles per hour and your humidity is at 91% and your sunset will be at 6 55 p.m. Let's look at this almanac. For your average temperatures, we have a high of 98, a low of 62. Monthly average of precipitation is at 3.35 inches, and your month-to-date is at 2.48 inches. On to the five cast. Saturday, it'll be sunny with a high of 79, a low of 58. Sunday, it'll be sunny with a high of 84, a low of 64. 
Monday, you'll have scattered thunderstorms with a high of 84, low of 67. Tuesday, you'll have thunderstorms with a high of 85, low of 68. Wednesday, you'll have mostly sunny skies with a high of 84 and a low of 67. So it'll be sunny. You may see some rain, but I hope that clears up. Me too. Yeah, I'm really hoping for that fall weather. Let's see what we're having for lunch on Monday. Breaded steak fingers, teriyaki chicken, Asian style rice, mashed potatoes, cream gravy, broccoli with cheese, dragon punch, Texas toast, a golden delicious apple, fruit cocktail, and of course, milk. Make sure to thank the lunch ladies. Now let's send things over to sports with Josh Kermeens. What's up, Cersei? Hope you guys are having a great day today. Without further ado, let's get into some sports announcements. Last night, your high school volleyball team went to Marion last night, and we do not have those scores yet. Also, the Cubs will face against Greenbrier tonight. We do not have those scores also yet. The most important part from these announcements, your Cersei football team will be traveling to West Memphis tonight. We got with Johnson Guthrie to see how their thoughts are for the better game tonight. Uh, I think it's going to go great. Coach has really been giving us the sauce and they bring, in, bring the juice to practice every day. So I believe we're going to go to the stadium and just bring the juice. Uh, we've been practicing every day. We've been going harder this week. Tuesday was our work day and we went uh, two times harder in that, during that day. So really just been grinding this whole week. Really just been working on finding the hole with my vision and just uh, hitting people when I need to, like blocking them and stuff. Bringing the juice when I need to. You guys better wish them luck or just they're not going to do their best without you wishing them luck. So like, wish them luck, you feel? But looking into some national sports, I would say the most important event, in my opinion, is the upcoming Monster Energy Race this weekend at Charlotte Motorway Speedway. Even if you don't watch it, I mean, who doesn't like watching people just race in circles for a couple of hours, am I right? On, some, on to some more exciting news, Joy is taking shots at Nike, like whoever thought of this coming. Man, I love beef in today's society, but the razor company Gillette came out, recently came out with a new ad campaign that showing others doesn't stop them at any fact. The fact that both of these companies are trying to see which one can make the country more mad is just great. <clears throat> Nike's merch is just uh, pretty cool in my opinion, but uh, let's see how all this goes for all of us. But uh, Cersei, this has been a very exciting show for me, but y'all have a great weekend and stay safe. I'll see you guys next week. I'm Josh Green, and let's send it back over to the news desk, I guess. Thanks, Josh, for those sports updates. That's all we have for today's show. Don't forget, if you miss an episode of, of Lion TV, you can catch us by going on www.cerseylionpress.com and clicking on the Lion TV logo to go to our web page, which hosts past episodes. And don't forget to follow us on Twitter at Lion TV and on Instagram and Facebook at Cersei Lion TV. Signing off, I'm Joshua Newhouse. And I'm Dakota Marsh. We hope you have a fantastic week, Cersei. See you next time on Lion TV.